Oh my god, why am I crying? <laughs> How long are they gonna tease this before we actually get to see her? Alicia, how are you? Be in the story. <clears throat> they just work her until she's dead and then shock her back. These look fun. <laughs> These look uh, radioactive. What the hell? Jerry, why does Spencer look like Hagrid on steroids? What does it do? Like make the mutant? Dude, this is gonna be <laughs> heartbreaking. That means I win. Watching Alex not know understand this game. Everything. Hey, but you know, maybe we have an unfair advantage too. <laughs> <laughs> you could be right. Greatest okay. human invention. The electric Printing light. Press. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. turn. <laughs> oh. I'm totally blanking. Um. No. <sighs> See, it's not just like super little stuff. It's Never so fails. much well, of their childhood that town. she doesn't. Sorry, guys. Can't remember uh, anymore. Hey, hey. Oh no, it's gonna be okay. There's nothing to end of the worldy. It's just an alien brawl at NCU. See ya. Right. Okay. No. I really just hope that Alex doesn't end up like turning on Supergirl because she doesn't know any better. She doesn't remember that's her sister, so she joins in on. The opposite side. We'll take it from here. Happy to help, Alex. Uh, one more thing. I would really appreciate it if you would address me as Director Danvers. Oh, oh uh, yes, of course, Director Danvers. No, this is painful. I mean, not knowing that my favorite movie is The Wizard of Oz, Eliza thought that I would relate to the adventures of a young girl being lost in a faraway land. It was, it was my favorite movie because I was from a different planet, and now Alex doesn't know that. There's so much that's going to be blank for her now, because so many of their experiences together were involving Supergirl. My source in the accounting department found a glitch in their numbers, called rumors of a black budget. He thinks it has to do with genetic testing. Genetic testing isn't illegal. If it wasn't shady, why would they keep it off the books? Dude, he is... He's gonna get in deep shit with her for that. Well, I, I want her to tell me yeah, that she's super Okay, cool. I'll try. So I'll drive. What? You, you yeah, go with me? her. Yeah, your town's like an oasis of tolerance, right? So I'll, I'll just pitch a story idea about it to James. Oh, God, that would be amazing. First commandment of road trips? Thou shalt defer to the driver's choice of music. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like she's going to confide in Nia because she doesn't really have anybody else to talk to about it. I really feel like that's what's going to happen. Something just doesn't feel right. Perhaps this will make I you feel better. I hate seeing Alex like this. I have discovered the species we apprehended last night. They're human? A human family took her in. Farmers. And she fell in love with their son. My dad. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. But also because I'm trans. I always knew that I was a girl. My parents were amazing. They affirmed my authentic self and helped me transition young. And I've always been able to be open about That's who awesome. I was in Martha's. I think if I grew up anywhere else, it would have been a lot tougher. Thank you for sharing that, that makes with me. me happy. Of course. I wish it was that Just way in my life. When you meet my family, please don't mention the dreaming powers. They don't know. I feel like she's going to tell her. Like, probably at the end of the dinner, she's gonna Good tell thing her. I drove. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you the name of my lawyer, Narc. <laughs> Fine, be that way. The substance they ingested was radicalized by 15 to the 19th power hertz worth of gamma rays. So is that finally, like, mixing the evil Supergirl in with this? Since that's what's caused for him? We're famous. No, no, we're rich. Here, <laughs> check out the comments. He's from Tagged. I'll have what they're having. Sue in Connecticut. We have the supply. Th Shoot, these dudes are so stupid. Why? Yeah, let's sell a drug people and make them evil. Hey. Whoa. Oh, it's a dream. <laughs> I thought that was like where they live. What the hell? This is all not oh. so pretty. Would you believe me now? I love when they have like happy scenes like this. <laughs> it's so awesome seeing like you look accepting oh, parents. Mom's a natural. I have labored to memorize the thirty Some of her mom's species gifts. of orchid. <laughs> Mia. She paints her dreams. So will I. 
Once my dreams finally kick in. You can't rush things, honey. Has Nia told you about our strange thinks, family legacy, Gara? She thinks she's gonna have them. One woman from every generation inherits the gift. Oh, so Just she's one? not going yeah. to. Just one. Nia is. Unless, of course, she's cursed with future blindness. <gasps> I told you when that I was means pregnant with you, Maeve's I dreamt that my daughter would have the gift. Blind. Just give it time. Hello, you have two daughters. What the f do you mean? I dreamt my daughter. You have two. I dreamt my daughter is gonna have the gift. Yeah, she does have the gift. It's just not that one. That's awesome that even though she's trans, she's still, obviously, still a woman, and it only passes down through women, and she still got the gift. Like that's freaking cool. Something is wrong with me. I mean, it's like something in my mind. It's missing. Imagine that her love for Kara and Supergirl is so strong that she's able to piece back her memories and figure it out again and know what it is that's missing like that'd be awesome if they did that something is wrong with me sean can i i, I don't know how to describe i would feel, it. I feel so feel bad knowing disconnected i feel the exact vulnerable. reason why she feels that way but not being able to tell her i never even wanted the powers i, I always wanted her. to be out in the world reporting especially since the mom's like people. i dreamt my daughter would have them and then stares straight at her like she doesn't have two daughters life. this is all she's ever wanted believe me i know how hard it is to hurt your sister but tell her you tell her i'm gonna talk to my mom if the mom reacts badly it's gonna break my heart like in disappointment that it went to nia and not mave you're gonna lie to her i don't Maybe it'll no, I hate this. Help her heal. She's fearless. Uh, I've always been envious of that. We all that's have kind of gifts. sad. What is the plan? Is he supposed to look like a frat boy? <laughs> Don't breathe a word to that witch. Of course not. I would never. Great acting skills, Rainy. You're really selling it. Jerry and Kev. easy <laughs> impressive chosen one doesn't have a choice it's in her blood tell her please don't be mom? disappointed oh mom? what the fuck i'm dying my love no you are the next dreamer my omelet was water oh. yours is fire oh this is so fire cool will make you far more powerful than i ever was you got this, baby. Why is this making me emotional? It was your destiny to be my daughter. To, to be dreamer. Oh. I'm so sorry. No, now she's gonna have to tell me. I didn't know though that the the mom or like the generation that was the dreamer before had to die for the next one to like become the full thing. Is that is that what just happened? Oh my god, my heart. I should have gotten the powers by now, Nia. It doesn't make sense. So is it maybe, not common that the person dies when the powers are maybe transferred? Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Game night training. <laughs> okay, listen, She's some so cute. Need to work on their communication skills, and others need to work on their competitive trivia skills. She is precious. She's just sitting there by herself, practicing. What was it you wanted to talk to me about? You better. It can work. He says that, and now he's gonna go behind her back, and she's gonna find out and be so hurt. Hope ten thousand is worth it. You're making a bunch of killers. Oh my god. What's she supposed to do? Is she gonna take one herself? I dreamt my mom drank an inky black fluid and turned into ash. That's why I trashed Maeve's art supplies. But I took the poison ink, literally. It was only a symbol. Of but death. how are you I supposed to know that, that? If I bothered to study like my sister, you didn't take anything from her. You didn't choose to be the sister with powers. Tell in her. In time, she'll understand that. But right now, you have to be Cara, honest. With you her. need to tell her so she feels like she's not alone in this. Nope, nope. She hasn't taken it yet. Oh shit. I'm really afraid that Maeve is gonna Why don't you and Cara come react. On? Angrily we'll towards Nia. Your mom came to me. Oh my god. I said this was for you. What is it? Is it the suit? Anyone who met my mom knows her light was blinding. 
And now people are gonna show up and I'm so lucky I got to bask the in children it. Children living are gonna ruin day. this. Uh oh. So she's gonna know. Because Nia saw that coming. And Supergirl's gonna appear out of nowhere. You have the powers. I can explain. Don't touch me. I knew she was gonna be angry. God damn it. Look at Nia being a hero. Ooh, she's helping. Oh, shit. Ah. Oh, shit. So since she doesn't remember, she doesn't have that, like, soft spot for the aliens and that part of her brain that doesn't want to kill them so easy. Why would someone... Because this world is filled with a lot of people that are bigger and stronger than her. And that kind of vulnerability, it makes you angry. Do you really think I don't know what it feels like to be vulnerable? No, I don't. Alex! And you either stand out or I will arrest you too. No. Did you know how hard that must be for Kara to have to hear that from her sister? And Alex has no idea. She's so used to Alex being on her side. You let me humiliate myself, think I was future blind. Oh no, it wasn't like that. So, do they, does the sister only get blind if it skips the generation? How so, like, let's you, say of all people get it the only goes to, like, to be passed down the from mom's granted. So how did someone like you get them? You're not even a real woman. Dude, fuck you. What a fucking cut. Sorry. Are you serious? The transphobia oh, jumps so right out. I know it's not the same thing, but if it makes you feel any better, I've been through a lot with my sister. Cara, tell her. I appreciate your support. This isn't something that you can understand. I have tell alien her. powers. My sister Cara. doesn't. And now, she hates me. Tell her. Oh, she's gonna tell her! Are you pulling over? She's gonna tell her. Yes, yes, take glasses off. I do understand. Probably better than anyone. Yes! <laughs> I am Supergirl. <laughs> because I think it can help you. Oh. I don't think it will harm you. You oh my God. are a hero. This is amazing. Oh my God. This is one of my favorite scenes they've ever done on this show. But I have faith that the love between two sisters will prevail in the end. I have to believe that. I just need you to know now that you are not alone. <laughs> oh my God. You have a family. Yes. You have me. Oh my God, why am I crying? <laughs> Amazing. That's everything that I wanted. Oh my god. That was awesome. That has to be the suit. Wait, so she gets the suit from her mom? I thought she would get it like from Brainy or them making it for her. Yes. Your hand. Oh, yes. Well, that is a lovely parting gift from Supergirl. How about we don't actually talk about work tonight? Yeah, I could do that. Now, watch the movie. She's if gonna you have to pretty much to form a whole new relationship. <laughs> if you it. want to live, shoot. Oh, you goober. No! Oh. 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 So they're bringing her in. Alright, there we go. That was season 4, episode 11 of Supergirl. Phenomenal. This is one of my favorite episodes of the series. Seeing Nia around her family and that entire dyna dynamic was amazing. And Kara going along with her. And let me say that Kara telling Nia that she was Supergirl is one of my favorite scenes this show's ever done. That was incredible and I'm so glad that for once Kara realized that it might benefit somebody to know. And she did it to make her feel less alone. And it was incredible. And I felt weird from the beginning with Nia's family. Not so much her mom as much, but the sister, I had a feeling that when she found out, she was going to react badly and pulled the whole, whole trans, transphobic, like, how do you have the powers if you're not a real woman? I knew she was going to say some crap like that. And that is heartbreaking. And I, I understand the anger for her not telling her, but to pull out the card saying, 
well, you're trans, so how do you have the powers if you're not a real woman? That's just so uncalled for and disgusting that I can't even... Someone is shooting a gun somewhere near this house, and I don't know why. But it just... That broke my heart to see Nia's face just drop when she said that. That is so disgusting to say to somebody, especially somebody that you love, and it just... So you're fine with her being who she is until it doesn't benefit you and then you're going to be transphobic. It's just disgusting. And it even made me mad too when the mom was like, I had a dream about my daughter having the powers. So you're going to get them and then look straight at the sister. But then later on, she did apologize for that and said that I should have known that it, there was a chance that it could be you too. And I'm, I'm happy with that. It's sad that she died, but I'm glad that they were able to have that conversation in the dream and she was able to kind of say goodbye to her mom. She got a suit. <sighs> Cannot wait to see her in the suit. We're going to see her in the suit next episode, I think. Oh my God. But the scene where Kara told her that she was super old was awesome. And she just couldn't take it anymore to make Nia feel like she was alone when she's not. And Kara understood her way more than she thought. It's still heartbreaking to see Alex be so against Sup Supergirl, and it's not even just that she doesn't know she's Supergirl. Wiping that part of her brain made it so she no longer remembers the connection that she really has to aliens, besides like Brainy and John. It's, it's not there anymore, because that deep connection that she has with alien rights was from Supergirl, and now that she doesn't remember who Supergirl is anymore, she doesn't really have that anymore. And she was so quick to kill that alien that was trying to defend himself and it's sad that that was a big consequence and it wasn't just wiping Kara from her memory it was wiping a big chunk of her life she grew up around Kara and even though they fought she grew up with Kara being Supergirl and knowing that she had powers and being there for her and witnessing all these things that happened that made them who they were and even though there's no negative side effect to it that's a big enough side effect that it affected her in a way that it changes who she is as a person and I really hope that there's a way they can undo that this is gonna break my heart if it stays this way or if they just have to retell her that she's Supergirl but even so it's not gonna bring back all that you know that all that stuff that she had learned growing up it's like it's I don't know it just doesn't work that way and it looks like we're finally seeing the evil Supergirl I don't know what it's considered um, but she was zapped back to life after they pretty much experimented on her until she died and a bunch of purple lightning spread throughout the world and put some type of superpower into these pills that made them like angry and like these mighty men like hulk type people and uh yeah so i don't know it looks like she's coming pretty close to being on the show it i mean i know she's on the show but like being with the other characters it looks like she's coming pretty soon and I didn't watch the promo for the next episode, but I'm thinking, like, maybe next episode they see her, or the one after that. I don't know. I, I think I think that she's definitely going to come soon, and that's going to be, like, the big bad that they're going to have to fight off until the finale. So I'm really excited for that and to dive deep into that, because they've been teasing that Kara for a long time, that Supergirl, for a long time. So really excited for that. Another phenomenal episode. Like this, honestly, I feel like I'd give this a 10 out of 10. I thought it was incredible. This is one of my favorite episodes they've ever done. And I'm so happy about it. And I'm really happy that James didn't go behind Lena's back. And even though they looked into it or he said that they looked into it, he ended up telling the girl that everything checked out, even though he knows that there is something sketchy going on. And I just, if he did that, that would have been like a whole different level of betrayal and I just I cannot cannot handle it but this season is getting so good I loved the episode I will see you guys in the next episode